Hello there, I am Janko with my Pokemon Yellow. In the last part, we took on the Fighting Dojo in Saffron City. We got a hip on Chan for winning against the Black Belt Master and uh, the Karate Master. And then we thought we were gonna start this of code, but then I decided to actually go on Second Road and go to Fusion and get the gym badge in Fusion City before I take on Sabrina. Cause Koga's gym is the fifth gym, apparently, according to our badges right here. Um, and, uh, our, you know, Sabrina's the sixth right there, so that's cool. So yeah, so, so I have a game up front, we're gonna take on uh, the second biker we see here, we took on the first one at the end of the last part, oh and we also battled Snorlax, and we, I meant to catch that one, but uh, we ended up fainting for its spirit, so the, so the other one, uh, south of Lavender Town, east of uh, the uh, route like 9 or whatever, of uh, that's east of uh, Vermilion City, we'll have to catch that one I guess. Nice buy, candid over, no, I would like to battle you instead. Okay, how about this? If I win, I get your bicycle, which you don't really show you have a bicycle, but in your sprite you do. Okay, but if I, but if you win, you can have my bicycle. How about that? <laughs> Cue ball, okay. I'm gonna chop, okay, level 28, cool. Let's go, gamer. Okay, so let's go for the bubble beam, I guess. So yeah, there we go, nice. Let's go for another bubble beam after this, and it should faint it. Let's get his cry chop on us, get a critical hit, of course you are. Of course, man, of course. Okay, so yeah, I'm gonna bump my thing there. I put my microphone on, sorry. Because I'm manky, okay, so yeah. Let's, uh, let's go for the, let's go for the bull beam, I guess. This mink is up 28, awesome. Okay, so yeah, there you go. The mink is in the red health, also. It's got to it's use focus energy and getting pumped, okay. Try to raise the chance of getting a critical hit. But let's go with the bite, and it takes it out, awesome. Gamer's now level 31, awesome, nice. Gamer's trying to win withdrawal. I do not want Gamer to win withdrawal, I'm sorry. <laughs> I just don't know and I better win withdrawal. Yes, of course, did not win withdrawal. Okay, cool. My chop. Okay, let's go to a different Pokemon. Let's go to Lavender, I guess. Okay, cool. Let's go for the Horn Attack, I guess. Why not? Smachup is level 28, just like the first one we saw in this battle, I believe. So it's gonna use Crash Up on us. Didn't do too much, it did like 11 HP, but not too much of 500 HP, so that's good. So he has a low kick this time, it's not gonna be very effective, but it does 8 HP, cool. Good for the Machop. Cool. Yeah, there we go, nice. I'm there, yeah, cool. You think you awesome. Knockout, thanks. I get your bicycle though, thanks for 700 pocket dollars. So we can switch camera with a uh, Brute Root, and then we'll switch Lavender with Brute Root, I guess. Why not? Okay, so cool. Uh, come on and play with... Play, come on and play a little mouse. I'm not a little mouse. I have big potential, man. I may be small, because I'm 10 years old apparently in this game. But you don't have to be such a bully and call me a mouse. That's not very nice. Okay, so this, this man is level 29, okay. Cool, let's go for the, um, how much will a double kick do, honestly, just out of curiosity. Uh, decent amount, actually, cool. Hit two times, awesome. Focus energy, you can use focus energy to try to raise your chance of getting a critical hit, but hopefully, Lavender can take you out to the dinner instead. Haha. -ha. There we go, nice. Cool. My chop is next, okay, so I'll use, actually, let's use Thrash on this thing. So my chop, this my chop is level 29, that's pretty cool. Yeah, cool. Let's get his crowd chop on us. Cool. Thrashing about nice. Lavender can finish it off, awesome. Lavender go level 31, awesome. Yeah, Steven we defeat Kubo, we defeat Kubo, haha. You little rat, I'm sorry. Thanks, you call me a rat now instead of a mouse, thanks. I really appreciate it. Not really. Thanks for the 725 perk dollars, man. So let's switch, uh, Switch with uh, Storm, I guess. Yeah. So if I put one on level 30, half my put one on level 31. Cool. Here's another biker dude. Let's take him on. Uh, I f I'm feeling hungry and mean. Are you hangry? Are you hangry or something? You're hungry and angry? Ha <laughs> ha This is another cute bot. He has one Pokemon. It's um, a chop. It's probably like level 30. Yeah, they're level 30. It's gonna be high level. Okay, so let's go for the Thunderbolt. Let's see how much this does. Does about half, a little bit over half. That's good for us. It's good as well. Kick on us. It does a little bit over half. Jeez. Okay. There we go. Storm is master than this Machop, which is awesome. And we take it out with a thunderbolt. Nice. 
If you keep well, cool. Okay, bad, bad, bad. Sorry, man. Let's finish eight hundred twenty-five fucking dollars, though. This is the last of the bike up here. There's more bikers on the run, of course, though. Hey, you just bumped into me. No, I did not. I just bike. I biked in front of you. I didn't even touch you, man. It's chill. Okay, this is a biker. Okay, he has a Pokemon. It's a Weezing. Cool. It's level thirty-three. Okay. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use Thunder Wave on this thing to paralyze it. And maybe it'll be fully paralyzed for its turn. Yes, it is awesome. That worked out great. Now I'm going to use the Super Potion on Storm to heal it up. Heal up Storm, I guess. And then can it be paralyzed again? Nope, of course not. Okay, fine. Okay, so let's go for the Thunderbolt then. See how much it does. I'm at least a big chunk, right? Yeah, quick cool, cool, nice. Let's get Smog, but it missed. Good. It's just not Thunderbolt. There we go. There we go. Quick cool, getting awesome. Nice. So strong good at level 31, awesome. Refeed biker, awesome. That's that's awesome too, I guess. Kaboom! Thanks for the 660 pocket always, man. Oh, there's another there's another biker there that caught me by surprise. Sure, I'll go. Okay, fine. Okay, so this biker has four Pokemon. Let's go for he has a grimer, okay, that's cool. That's cool. Let's go for the Thunderbolt. It almost finds it. Cool. It's gonna, it's gonna pound on us. Okay, let's go for the Thunder Shock then. Haha. <laughs> nice. There we go. Nice. We take out the Grimer. But use Grimer. Okay, let's switch Pokemon then. Let's go to Grumpy. This Grimer is level 30, 26, I should say. Yeah. Let's go for the Body Slam. Just pound on us, okay. Fine. Let's go for the seismic toss then. Yay. Nice. And it faints it awesome. That's good. He's another grammar, of course. You have three grammars so far out of your fourth Pokemon. Not to say that's a bad thing, but you gotta have some variety too if you want to if you want to win Pokemon battles, of course. But who am I to judge another trainer? That's not very nice. I'll stop now, I guess. Okay, so this says my talk should take it out. It does. Awesome. Cool. Because, okay, so it has four Grimers. Okay. So we'll just do the same thing. We'll use, uh, Body Slam and then Seismic Toss. That sounds like a plan to me. The seismic, this, uh, Grimer is level 26 and it goes down because of critical hit. Awesome. Nice. Okay, uh, don't make me mad. Sorry, man. <laughs> Thanks for having me with Pocket Always, though. Okay, so let's switch, uh, Storm with the Grumpy, I guess. Grumpy, yeah, there we go. So there should be a biker right around here, actually. Oh, right there, awesome. Let's take him. Let's take him on. Okay, you're heading for Fusia? Yes, I am. I am heading for Fusia. This is biker wants to fight, of course. Okay, it's a Weasoning, okay. It's a Weasoning, <laughs> I like a Weasoning. Okay. Let's go for the Body Slam, I guess. There we go, nice. It hits, and it does one third. Okay, cool. Maybe we could paralyze it, because there's a 30% 30 30 chance of paralyzing it. There we go, awesome. Right on cue. So, uh, yeah, it's fully paralyzed. Let's give it a seismic toss. Let's toss it, baby. Ha ha ha. There we go, nice. Awesome. Grumpy's in the level 31, awesome, yay. Okay, Biker's about to use coughing. Let's switch to, uh, Brute Root then. Yeah, it's coughing level 28. It looks so happy. Like, it's like, hey, I'm gonna win this battle. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Uh, let's go for the... How much does a raise leaf do just out of curiosity? Now, it's not very effective, but I'm just curious how much it will do. Let's see here. Maybe we can even get a quit or something. That'd be nice. How much does... Okay, maybe I'll stick with raise leaf because I think tackle... Well, let's see how much tackle does. Just, out, just to compare it. And yeah, tackle does a little bit less than raise leaf, actually. Cool. So let's go with raise leaf then. It missed, of course it did. Of course it did, yeah. That's great, Boot Root, you missed. Okay, so yeah. There we go, it's putting the yellow, and it has a chance of getting a critical hit, because it has, basically it has a high critical hit ratio, which is nice. Basically, if it gets, I hope it doesn't faint it, though, that'd be nice. There we go, nice. 
have to use a Weasling. I'll switch to uh, Tabasco actually. Tabasco hasn't had much, uh, didn't have screen time at all in the last part, I believe. So let's make that a change. Maybe even the last last part too. You have a reaction, you know, screen time. Let's go for the Ember attack. This could use Sludge on us. That's a powerful poison type move. Yeah, and it poisoned Tabasco. Of course it did. Fine, I'll use Ember again. Hopefully we can get like a cool hood or something, you know. Or burn it too, you know, that'd be nice. Let's go for Tabasco. Ember would get nice. I burned it. Awesome. Nice. Like, that's almost on cue, basically. Let's get attack on us. Okay. Hurt by the burn. Okay. Let's go for the Ember. My Ember should do it with the help of the burn. Let's get attack on us. With the ember again, I guess. Nice. Tabasco's not level 32. Awesome. Yeah. Crash and burn. Sorry, man. Thanks for 560 pocket dollars. I think if you press B, you can stop and hold your break like that. Like this part, you just automatically go down like that. But I'm gonna go back to the Pokemon Center and heal. So I'll see you guys in a second. Okay, I'm back. Um, I'm gonna switch Brute Root and uh, Grumpy, I guess, because Brute Root's the level 30. So yeah. Okay, so I think there's another uh, bike here somewhere. Maybe on the left, right side, I mean. Yeah, there's one, and there's another. Nice. Is there one up here, though? Like, I don't think there is, but I want to check. Okay, no. Cool. So in this wild grass, I think you can catch a new Pokemon called Dodrio, or Doduo. Dodrio is actually the ball form. It makes a great flying type. I've seen Blah Blah Peas use it as Pokemon Leaf Green. Uh, let's play it, and it was actually a pretty cool Pokemon. Not many people really use it, but it has a good potential with like try attack and everything. Cause it can, it has a chance of burning, freezing, or paralyzing, cause it's like a, it uses like lightning and uh, fire and ice and attack, which is pretty cool. I think it's still a normal type of attack though. What do you want, kiddo? I want a battle, of course. See, it makes a great Pokemon. I haven't used one in my playthrough yet. I'm still baffled on how it can fly though, honestly. It's like an ostrich. A three-headed ostrich room. Do is a two-headed ostrich, basically, and through Doug Trio is like a three three-headed ostrich. Let's go for the razor leaf on this Machop. It's level twenty-nine, so a level ahead of it. That's cool. I'm not saying that we exactly have the upper hand, but uh, ooh, quick quick. Now we have the upper hand. Haha. <laughs> cool. Ooh, it's the, okay, yeah, it's good. It gives Machoke next. Okay, we use razor leaf on this thing. It's level twenty-nine. Cool. Razor leaf hits. That's awesome. Let's see how much this does. Um, it does. Ooh, critical and nice. It does like the majority of its HP. Let's get his weird on us. Okay. So let's use a uh, vine whip to finish it off, hopefully. There we go. Nice. Cool. Brute Root good level 31. Yay. I want to keep it up front because then a Brute Root uh, Vizzler evolves at level 32 into Venusaur. So that'd be pretty cool. So yeah. Woo. Thanks for selling your Twitter book. It always, man. Here's another biker guy, so let's battle him. There's no money for in fighting kids. There's no more. Is the, did she say no money or no mercy? I can't even remember. I didn't read that right, probably. Okay, so keep all. Yeah. It's one of the other, probably. So that might get okay, cool. So we was gonna use a razor leaf on this thing. Haha. <laughs> there we go, nice. Okay, no, it's not nice for us because it just got a critical hit on us. Jeez, this mic is level 29, so maybe we can faint it in one hit, that'd be awesome. Awesome, critical, nice. Yeah, but these prime up, okay, we'll stick in with the brute, I guess. So yeah, let's go for the vine whip, or not vine whip, but basically if again, it's gonna use focus energy trying to get pumped and uh, try to raise this chance of getting a critical hit on us, but hopefully we can take it out before that happens. So let's at least do a half, right? Okay, to Chris Quigley did more awesome. Let's go for the vinyl to try to finish it off. Let's get his Fury Swipes on us, okay. So it's gonna hit twice at least, okay. Let's get it three times. And it's gonna hit four times. And it's gonna hit, okay, if I said and it's gonna hit, it's probably egging it on and jinxing it. Jeez. But it only hit four times, that's good. Nice, okay. There we go, we defeat Cue Ball, cool. Burned out, sorry man, thanks for so much for for Poké Dollars though. Uh, what's over here? I think there's another biker. Yeah, here he is. Let's take him. Let's take him on. Let Voltorb Dodge to fight you. I don't want Voltorb Dodge to fight my Pokemon. That's not very nice. 
Because there's another biker. He has two Pokemon. One's probably a Voltorb, yeah. Like in his dialogue. I'm gonna use Mega Drain on this thing. Just try to get Beard some more HP back. You know, because Mega Drain heals your Pokemon. It, it restores half the inflicted damage, uh, on a, on the enemy. So yeah. So say like it did like 10 HP with the damage on a, a Pokemon of your opponent, then it'll gain back like 5. 5 HP, because that's half of what it was inflicted on your enemy, your opponent, I should say. So let's use another, uh, yeah, let's use light screen again, but yeah, it didn't work. But yeah, let's use another Mega Drain here. And then let's use a Raze Leaf, I guess. Sonic Boom, now that's gonna do 20 HP, so we will be left with 33 HP. Simple math, you know, 53 minus 30, minus 20 is 33. Teehee. Okay, so yeah, final pits, that's good. It takes it out, critical and nice. Cool. And you have another Voltorb, that's nice. Okay. Cool, you have two Voltorbs, and I think they were both they're both level twenty nine, except for I don't I didn't pay attention to what that other that other Voltorb had. Like what level I should say. It's gonna use it used Sonic Boom, I guess. So hopefully we can restore enough twenty six HP. So if you use Sonic Boom again, it would only go down to six HP. This gives light screen though, okay. That's cool I guess. Not good first though. There we go, nice. Let's give it another Mega Drain. Let's get a Screech on us to lower Brute's, uh, Brute's uh, defense. Great, and it's gonna greatly fall, apparently, like it said right there. It's cool, I guess. Not very, not actually, that's not very cool for us. Uh, hopefully, one more Mega Drain should faint it, but you never know. Make uh, White Screen fail that time, and good. Takes it out, awesome. Brute would get off 32, yay! So Brute's gonna evolve, yay! We feared Biker, cool. Uh, Grounded out, yeah, that's what he says. Okay, so let's go for the 580 pocket hours. What boot is evolving? Yeah, it is. Nice. There we go, boot evolved into the Venusaur, yay. Cool. So let's switch, uh, boot with, um, Gamera, I guess. So yeah. Is there another biker here? Here's the, that is another biker right on cue, haha. <laughs> Not exactly right on cue though. My Pokemon won't evolve, why? I think he has a Machoke and he's like wondering how he can get him a champ. Well, he has to trade his Machoke with someone to evolve it. Because it evolves through trading. Through a trade, I should say. So, poor Machoke's level 33 and I'm a champ, yeah, I'm sorry. Sorry, guy. Let's go for the um, Bobby Beam. So, yeah, let's see what this does. It does about one third, cool. And, uh, let's try an Ice Beam, actually. See what this does. Does about the same amount. Okay, cool. I'll hopefully finish with the bulb beam though. It's gonna use a little kick on us though. Does a it does about half. Jeez, okay. Let's go for the bulb beam again then. And there we go, nice. Cool. Game uh, yeah, game that much experience, cool. Ready for your cube awesome. A thousand experience plus, I think. Wow, why are you? Sorry man, thanks for hundred twenty five dollars, but you have to trade your Machoke to get my champ. That's just a rule, I guess, in Pokemon. That's how it evolves, really. Uh, it took this guy. Be a rebel. I don't want to be a rebel. I want to be a good guy. We talk about Star Wars rebels? No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> so this is a cue ball. He has two Pokemon. One is a primate. Okay, cool. So it's level 29. Gamera is level 31, so it's two levels higher than it. But see, a bulb beam. It's gonna scratch chop on us though. Because it's faster, apparently. Let's go for the bulb beam and see how much this does. It did about over one third. That's, that's cool. Uh, let's heal up with a uh, super potion. Let's heal Gamera up with the super potion, I should say. Yeah, it's, it's gonna use Rage on us, okay. That's not that's not the least of my concern. I did less than uh, Karai Trap, which is good, but it got a quick quit. But yeah, speed fell, so I think uh, that helped Gamera attack first, I guess. Rage is building attack rows. Oh no, it's gonna use Rage again. Okay, so uh, let's go for the water gun to finish it off, hopefully. Let's see if it does, though. It does awesome. Okay, well, I was about to use my choke, okay. We'll stay in. Let's go for the bubble beam. This is my choke is level 29, so that's pretty cool. Speed fell, okay, cry chop, okay. So it does 22 HP because of a quick hit. Jeez. Let's go for the bubble beam. I, I might regret not healing there, but uh, let's hope uh, Gamma can stay strong. Okay, cry chop, how much will that do? It'll faint, it'll faint Gamma because of a quick hit, probably. Dang it. Okay, that stinks. Let's go to, um,. Let's get a storm, I guess. Finish it with the thunder shock, I guess. 
Okay, yeah. Good fake cable, nice. Okay, um, arg. Thanks. <laughs> Sorry, you seem mad. Thanks for so much for dollars. I'm gonna go back and heal real quick. Okay, I'm back, and uh, we'll see if we can find another uh biker, I guess, to battle. Already battled him. Okay. Um, is that the end of the I think there's a couple more trainers though. So let's check around here. Let's check on the left side, because I don't think we battled all of them on the left side. There we go, there's another one. Cool. Okay, nice bike. How's it handle? It, it handles pretty good. I'll be honest. It does, it does. Nice. My my right hand fell asleep, so that kind of stinks. Okay, as a wheezing, it's level 29. Cool. Okay. Let's go to Gamma then. Uh, Gamma, let's use Bulb Beam, I guess. Let's see how much this does. It does about one third. Dang it, speed fell though. Cool. It's just, it's just attack on us. Good. That's not the best move I could probably use on us, so that's good. Speed fell. It's gonna smog. Oh no. It's a poison type move. Okay, there we go. Nice. Let's get this bulb beam. Hopefully, we can go like, faint out with a cool hit. Nope, of course not. Guess it's gonna hang on, apparently. Which kind of stinks. It's gonna, po it's gonna poison us, too. It's not good. Let's go for the bite then to finish it off. Camera good level 32. Awesome. Uh, bike is about to use muck. Okay. Switch Pokemon. Yes, I'll switch to, um, I guess I'll switch to Lavender. Yeah, this muck is level 29, that's pretty cool. So, uh, let's go for the, um, Thrash, I guess. See what this does. Does about one third. Cool. It's gonna pound on us, okay. Thrashing about nice, okay. This muck is still gonna use, okay, it's gonna stapled. And, uh, you're gonna disable Poison Sting, okay, that's good. As long as you don't disable th Thrash. Poison gas that didn't affect lavender. Okay, so it's good. lavender's gonna be confused though, so it's just horn attack and hopefully it'll, get, it'll uh, attack, but it hit self confusion that time. Dang it. Poison attack, poison gas that didn't affect lavender. Good. Oh man, it hit self confusion though again. Nice. Uh, not nice, not nice. That's bad for us. Horn attack again. Oh, uh, let's see. It's Oh my gosh, I'm, I'm being so unlucky right here. Jeez. Jeez, it's down to 15 HP. Disabled no more, confused no more. Good. Take out with the horn attack, I guess. Nice. Shoot. Thanks for the 508 Poké Dollars, man. Okay, so, uh, um, Gamma has poison, so I'll use an antidote. But we'll put Lavender in front and give him a super potion, actually. It's a super potion on, uh, Lavender. I guess we'll use a potion, too. There we go, nice, okay. And we'll use the antidote on, uh, what, Grump, G Gamera, yeah, there we go, nice. Cool. Yeah, I think there's a biker in here, too. I could be wrong, though. Ah, huh, maybe I'm wrong. I think I'm wrong if I haven't seen a biker right now in this little area. Yeah, okay. Wait, did I already bother you? Okay, no I didn't. Okay, that answers my question. We bikers. We're bikers. Highway stars. Cool. I'm glad you f I'm glad you feel so great about yourself, you know? We're, in t we're over 25 minutes in recording time, but I kind of want to finish the cycling road in this part, so that's probably what I'm going to do. Unless I get really tired for some reason, which I'm not that tired, honestly. I'm a little tired, but uh... I'm not that tired. Okay, so I'm gonna just use horn attack because apparently, you know, Thrash kind of bit me in the butt last time I fought this a muck, which was last trainer's muck that was like level 29. Uh, because it, I get hurt by the, I get you know, lavender kept on hitting itself in confusion like three times in a row. So let's just go with the old, good old uh, horn attack. And after this horn attack, it should probably take one more horn attack to faint this thing. Could quit. Okay, that kind of worries me because if that was a quick quit, I might have not faint it. You know. Let's go for the horn attack again. It hits that time. It hits again, I should say. Yeah, it's, it hung on by the skin of its teeth. Jeez. Thrash was disabled. I wasn't trying to use Thrash. Let's go for the uh, double kick. I hope it'll finish it off quick quick. Nice. There we go. Okay, yeah. Smoked. Thanks, man. Thanks for 660 Poké too. 660 Poké Dollars. Um, I already bowed you, right? Yeah, I did. Okay, cool. Okay, I think I battled most, the majority of the cycling road trainers, not the bikers, I should say. Bi bikers and cue balls. I, already, I just battled you, okay, cool. So let's see here. Break. 
break. I'm just stopping randomly. <laughs> That's funny. Okay, I didn't bow you apparently. I need a little exercise. Okay, we can back around second word after I beat you in this battle. Hopefully, I'm hoping I can beat you because I don't want to black or white. I don't want to black out or white out. So yeah, cue ball. Okay, cool. He sent out Mankey. Mankey. How much will I double kick, dude? Just out of curiosity. Let's see. Let's see how much it'll do. Does about a third. That's awesome. Hit two times. Okay, it's gonna just cry chop on us. And it's critical, of course. Let's go for the horn attack to help you finish it off. Let's see if this finishes off the Mankey that's level 26. It does, cause Kukulit, or maybe cause Kukulit. And then, yeah, we'll have to go level 32. Awesome. We'll have to do at 100 HP now. Awesome. Okay, level 32. Uh, let's go to, uh, Grumpy then. Or maybe Storm, actually. Yeah, let's go Storm. This Mankey is level 26, just like the last one. Let's go for the Thunderbolt. See, let's see here, yeah. There we go, nice. Take out the main game one hit, awesome. Storm Gear level 32, yay. Keep balls about this much hook, okay. Let's go to uh, Grumpy then. Let's go for the body slam, see how much it does. It does, uh, ooh, it does a lot of damage. Almost fainted it because it could go ahead, nice. So let's go to, um,. Let's go seismic toss it then, yeah. There we go, nice. So about these Machop, okay. His last Pokemon, it's a Machop, that's level 26, okay, cool. So he's body slam on this thing. Okay, yeah, I paralyzed it too, nice. Okay, let's, uh, we'll kick it, I guess. There we go, cool, cool, nice. I'll take it. You feel cute, but awesome. Phew, a good workout, thanks. Six hundred fifty, sixty, six hundred fifty 650 pocket dollars, there we go. So, uh, everyone's level 32 except for Grumpy, but Grumpy is close to level 32, I bet, so that's good. We are about you. Let's go across this part. I think we already about the people over there. If I did miss someone, I apologize, but I think this might be the last biker I was training on this road. Get uh, on Sakuma Road. Get lost, kid. I'm bust. I'm. I'm bus, uh, bushed. I, I may have misread that last part of the dialogue. Here's another biker, I guess you could say it's five Pokemon. Let's see, it's coughing. Cool. Yeah, there's level 25 coughing. That's good. Uh, that's good for him, I guess. Let's go for the body slam. There we go, nice. We're gonna use Weezing next, okay. Or a Weezing. Let's go for the body slam. Okay, didn't, okay, did a little bit of one third, that's good. Let's go for the body slam again. It's gonna get paralyzed at that time, awesome, nice. Fully paralyzed, nice. Okay, let's go for the seismic toss to finish it off. So this should finish it off, by the way. There we go, nice. Come good, level 32, yay. I guess about these coughing, okay, we'll switch to Tabasco, I guess. Okay, Ember, okay, cool. Nice. Let's go for the Ember again. Okay, yeah, coughing, yay. Yeah. Okay. Let's use the Ember again, I guess. Right, yeah, Ember. Cool. Let's use the Ember again. And we'll probably finish it off with an Ember, honestly. Ember, Ember, Ember. Haha. <laughs> nice. One more Pokemon, it's a Weezing. Cool. Let's stick with Tabasco and just use Ember. Ember it up, Tabasco, I should say. Cool. Let's get a Sludge on us, which is a powerful poison type move that we saw probably earlier in this part where someone was one of the poison type Pokemon, probably Weezing took, used it. Yeah, and Tabasco's poison. That's just great. Two more embers should take it out. But I'm hoping this wheezing isn't gonna faint Tabasco though, that'd be bad. But it looks like he's trying to, you know? But well, that's the object of the game of Pokemon, but I was trying to make sure the other Pokemon reaches zero HP before you do. You know? <laughs> that's kinda how it goes, I guess. So there we go, nice. What do you feel, Biker? Awesome. 
Are you satisfied? Yes, I am. Thanks. Thanks for five hundred pocket dollars. So I'm gonna use a antidote on a uh, Tabasco just so he doesn't faint from poison. I'm gonna put I'm gonna put Tabasco at the front though too. Oh yeah, we'll use um a couple of potions I guess. Cool, yeah, that's good. Okay, so yeah, there we go, nice. Let's go down this road again. I think that's the last train I want to battle, honestly. Because this part's already getting long. It's already up to 32 minutes in recording time. I think you can fish here to get like shelters or something with, us to, with like a good rod or something. Sure, we haven't even got the good rod yet. But yeah. So uh, there's some bird keepers. Um, I'll face them, I guess. Why not? We might as well just finish these three guys and battle, or battle them all and then make it to Fusion City. I'm always check every gr grassy area for a new Pokemon. That's actually a really good idea. If you're looking for other Pokemon and whatnot. Or just looking for Pokemon to catch in general. Bird Keeper wants to fight. Okay, cool. It's not that Sparrow. Nice. It's level 29. Cool. Tabasco. Let's use Ember on this thing. It does about half and it burned it. Nice. Awesome. So it cuts its attack in half probably. So yeah, Fury Attack is probably physical. I don't know for sure, but maybe. If Fury Attack it twice, hurt by the burn. Okay. So hopefully Ember and the, with the help of the burn will faint the Spearow. Oh uh, yeah, Ember will cool single handle you after that. Nice. But you keep resorting to Fury. Okay, we'll stay in. We'll stay in. Let's go for that Ember. Because we were moved, but there's a move, we move failed because he went first actually. Couldn't move, the move. Huh. Let's go for the Ember again. Let's get his wheel on us to lower Tabasco's defense. Cool. Let's get his Ember again. Let's get his Growl on us to lower our attack, or to lower Tabasco's attack, I should say. Yeah. Let's get his, okay, we burn it. Nice. Cool. Let's use Ember. Hopefully, with the help of the Ember and the burn, uh, it'll faint it. That'd be nice. Okay, nice. I think did it. Awesome. Tabasco level 33. Awesome. Let's try to learn Slash. Ooh, okay, cool. Yeah. Trying to move the full moves. Still don't move to make him for Slash? Yes, of course. Which we should be forgotten. Let's get rid of Growl. One, two, and poof. Tabasco for Growl and Tabasco and Slash. Nice. We for Bird Keeper. Awesome. Tuh. Thanks for 725 Poke Dollars. I'm gonna switch to Storm for these next two. Battles. And switch to Basco with Grumpy, I guess. Okay, so yeah, there we go. Nice. Okay, this is my turf. Get out of here. Sorry, man. Sorry, man. I didn't mean to have, take over your turf, I guess. So this bird keeper is... Yeah, just bird keeper, I guess. <laughs> it's pretty okay. Level 26. Let's... Do not storm, I guess. Let's go for the Thunderbolt. There we go. Nice. This should have fainted, I'm pretty confident. And it does, awesome. It's super effective. He's about to send out Sparrow, okay, you have three more Pokemon, including the Sparrow. So you have two more Pokemon after this. The Sparrow is also level 26, it should go down with this Thunderbolt, nice. And it does. And... Sparrow is about to use, uh, Sparrow. Bird Keeper is about to use Sparrow, so stay in. The Sparrow is level 26, cool. That's just great. There we go, nice quickly, awesome. Bird Keeper is about to spear, okay, cool. We'll stay in. I think the last uh, Bird Keeper is like a Dodrio, which is pretty cool. The Vault Form of Dodrio, so you'll see it for a second, I guess, in battle. Cool, we defeat Bird Keeper, nice. Darn, sorry man, thanks for 650 pocket always though. Because this one right here. Yeah, cool, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, coo coo coo. How do you like my bird call? I did a bad bird call myself, but yeah, I like your bird call better than mine. Good job. So this is another bird keeper. He has one Pokemon. It's probably a Dodrio, like I said. Yeah, three three heads for that Dodrio. It's level thirty four. Wow. Okay, that's pretty good. It's just tack not tackle, but tail not tail up. Thunderbolt. There we go. Th Thunderbolt almost faints it. Awesome. Good drill pack. Oh, drill pack's really powerful. It's a really powerful fire, flying type move, but it's not very effective, but it did that much damage. Jeez, let's go for the quick attack. Hopefully, to finish it off. Nope, it doesn't. Dang, I should have gone for the thunder shock, but that's okay. Let's go for the quick attack. 
Good thing the Ostadok missed. Nice. There we go, nice. I keep, I had a bug, I had, I had to bug you, I'm sorry man. Thanks for 850 poker dollars, I think that was you gave me. 850, 850 poker dollars. That was a Spearow, and with that, a uh, Storm Grid level 33, so yeah, it's awesome. Trying to learn agility, no, I don't want to teach uh, Storm Agility, I'm sorry. So yeah, but I don't want agility, yes, okay, cool, I don't want agility, okay. So that Spearow is level 22, and it, uh, it fainted, uh, Storm fainted it with one thunder shock. So what I'm going to do off screen is I'm going to train all my Pokemon up to level 35. So, because uh, I think another training session is due, kind of. So yeah, but first we want to make it to Future City finally, so I'll do that. We made it to Future City, yay! So we'll explore Future City in the next part too. Maybe take on the Safari Zone, I don't know. I'll probably take on the Safari Zone, that seems like fun. So yeah, okay, so I just healed up there, so that's pretty cool. Uh, again, all my Pokemon will be level 35 in the next, at the start in the next part. So yeah, spend that on my Pokemon, y'all walk through that part, and the next part will take on, uh, maybe this fire zone. Uh, there's some trainers south here that can battle, like, their swimmers, I think, because of the water type Pokemon. So that's pretty cool. Uh, and, uh, yeah, that's pretty cool. I think that's about it. We might just take out the, the Safari Zone and whatnot. So yeah, so if you enjoy it, go again. I would like to thank you for giving goodbye. And I'll put you guys in the part of my Pokemon Yellow Walkthrough Guide.